grab a cup of tea, maybe grab a blanket, and just come and join me for a cosy autumn day in London. Good morning! <laughs> just done some yoga with my housemate. Now I'm on my way to the shop just to pick up some ingredients as I'm about to make some pumpkin pancakes. Honestly, I'm so excited by this one. I saw the recipe on Instagram the other night. I was like, oh, I have to make this. I've literally not stopped thinking about them since I saw it. So yeah, just going to see that. But I have to say, the air this morning it's so nice. It's just got a little bit of a crisp in the air. It's like slightly chilly. It's perfect for fluffy jumpers. And time for a cozy autumn day with a bit of productivity in there as well because I've got a lot to do. Join me for the day. got uh, quite a lot to get done today. Thought I'd take myself on a lovely little walk over to Putney and try and find a cafe to just do some work there. Let's pack the bag and get going. <laughs> So I've made it to Putney, uh, but I've done a little bit of procrastination. <laughs> um, so even though I'm meant to be doing these drawings, uh, I stopped off at Photoshop, get a couple of photos printed so that I can put them in frames in my room, and then I walked past Flying Tiger, and uh, well, it's just a dangerous move, isn't it? Uh, they've got all their like Halloween stuff out, but I had to restrain myself, not pick up any decorations, and instead, I mean it is a decoration, but you know, anyway, instead I picked up this lovely like autumn candle holder, nearly at Gail's Cafe now. I'm not sure if any of you guys have heard of the YouTuber Unjaded Jade, but I really enjoy her videos. And one thing she talks about is this, this like theory of casual magic, which is where you take a little moment to appreciate something lovely in today. So, as I'm on my walk back across Putney Bridge, on one side of the bridge, we have this lovely sun sunset and then on the other side of the bridge just there can you see the moon it's it's always one of those things where on camera it never looks as good as in person but the moon looks so gorgeous in this like pastel purple sky <sighs> that's the casual magic of today it's moments like these where i i just feel so lucky like to be in London, to be an architect, I know that today I'm sort of romanticising my day in terms of, you know, showing all the good bits and of course that doesn't, it doesn't show the bits where it's like me and H&M getting upset because I, uh, I'm not feeling confident with my body image as I'm trying on clothes, but you know, in general, today has just been so lovely and even though all of today I've been sort of working on a project for a friend I think I've just sort of taken it steady and if there's been something that's 
you know, caught my eye, like this sunset, for example, I've just made sure to actually make the most of it and sort of not stick to a rigid schedule, hence why I'm taking a longer route home. I don't know what I'm trying to say, other than I feel so lucky. And I, I really hope, uh, you know, any of you guys who are studying to be architects or who are recent grads, I, I really wish you can, you know, experience the same. I th think sometimes it is just the little things in life that are the best things in life. I know I tend to watch a lot of YouTube in the background of working or whilst like eating on my own or something. So if you're one of those people, I hope this gives you a bit of coziness. And if, you, if not, if you're just like watching this on the go, I maybe hope this inspires you to start that task that you've really been putting off for months and months and months and maybe just make a lovely little like day out of it and just do the best that you can. You've got this.